In this video, I'm going to show you how to aseptically pour triptych soy agar bacterial growth media into petri dishes. Before I do that, I'm going to need to light my Bunsen burner in order to sterilize the neck of my bottle. To light my Bunsen burner, I make sure it's hooked up to the gas supply, and then I turn the handle of the gas supply so that it's parallel with the nozzle. That means the gas is on. I then light my match and run it up the side of the barrel of the Bunsen burner. Up the side until it meets the gas and ignites the flame. Don't hold the match over the top of the Bunsen burner. If the flame is set high, you can burn yourself. I can adjust that flame with the cog at the bottom of the Bunsen burner, and I want a small, bright blue cone. Once I've retrieved my TSY from the warming oven, I need to gently mix it up. I'm going to swirl the bottle just a little bit. I don't want to shake it or create any bubbles, just gentle swirling motion. Then I can remove the cap and I'm going to need to sterilize the neck of the bottle. When I take that cap off, I don't set it on the counter. I don't even hold it open side up because that could contaminate it. I run the neck of the TSY bottle through the flame and now I'm ready to pour my plates. Make sure your Petri dishes are located as close to the Bunsen burner as possible in case you need to re-sterilize the neck of your bottle. You can pour about three or four plates before you need to run the neck of that bottle through the flame again. When pouring the plates, open up that lid only as far as you need to. You can pour about a quarter inch of liquid into the, that bottom section of the Petri dish. You'll fill it about halfway up and then immediately close it back up. So again, after pouring three or four, I would want to re-sterilize the neck of that bottle if I were going to pour more. I'm done. I'm only going to pour four in this video, so I'm going to sterilize the neck of the bottle and recap the bottle. I want to return that to the warming oven as soon as I've turned off the flame to my Bunsen burner. I'm all done with it, so I turn the handle so it's perpendicular to the nozzle. Do not move your plates for 10 to 15 minutes. They need that time to set up and cool off. 